Hey man, it's the ISO God Sensei, the greatest nigga on 2K in existence. And listen up, man, we got some exclusive 2K23 gameplay and build news. Shakedown has made a new video indirectly talking about how the builds are gonna be, how the gameplay is gonna be. And he's making quite a few suggestions, man. So I'm going, I'm gonna break this down for y'all on my brainiac and give y'all more uh news man so make sure y'all watch this full video man drop a like helps out the vid a lot make sure you subscribe if you're new turn them notice and yeah man one of the first things i noticed when i was playing 2k23 was the lack of chase down block lack of chase down block so what is he saying paid defense is gonna be ass okay you know chase down block should be there but it shouldn't be to where the only reason chase down blocks are good is because they slowed the dunking and layup animation <laughs> like, come on, bro. What's going on? And the excessive amount of layups that were going in. Excessive amount of layups going in. Okay. Excessive amount of layups going in. When have y'all ever heard that? Shit? Okay. This is the golden boy for 2K23. He is the only creator that flew out there, came back, and, you know, made videos on it, man. So, excessive layups going in i i've never heard anyone say some shit like that before and then the title of this is jelly layups are back so our is gonna be laying it in on your ass contested going crazy acrobat shit. this the year of the acrobat <laughs> is, it, is this what's going on i, I know i know it was playing now but i mean man paint me foots was already trash he's saying excessive excessive I don't know. <laughs> y'all let me know how y'all feel about it. It felt like 2K toned down the paint defense with regards to chase down blocks. Felt like 2K toned down the paint defense when it came to chase down blocks. And kind of increased the likelihood of layups going in. I even saw... Increased the likelihood of layups going in. I don't think he understands how insane this is. With how bad paint defense has been. Like, I don't, I don't think he understand, man. Y'all let me know if paint defense is um terrible for you, man. Contact for some reason it always be the people who are like bad at the game that think there's paint defense in the game. And they like face no type of exploiters or comp people. I don't know. It's it's so weird. It's so weird. Layups going in. This is actually a good thing because layups good was thing. kind of a lost art in 2K20. Lost art. Like when was the last time you made a build that has an 80 driving layup oh, to right. get those jelly layups? Most of the point guards that we see dribbling. Yeah, it, it was a lost art. I mean, but no one ever really did it because, you know, Duncan's more secure. So I don't know how they would implement the effectiveness of layups, but I mean, bro, like, if I'm over there jumping at little Timmy and He's just making layups, bro, and it's just easy. I don't, I'm, I'm not a fan of that, bro. If he can't get wide open, I, I'm not a fan. You know, y'all y'all let me know how y'all feel about it. From left to right, the moment they go to the rim, they have I can understand and like take over, like you start doing some crazy shit and like it'll always go in, like the layups, like if not blocked, like I, I, can, I can get stuff like that, but just running into niggas and just like going crazy. <laughs> I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't fuck with that shit. You have to stop and wait for everybody to jump just to get a layup. With all that being said, for those of you guys that are going to make PGs for 2K23, I highly recommend you make a build that highly has a high recommend. layup rating or just the ability to finish at the rim. Highly recommend a build with a high layup rating. Interesting. So today I'm going to give you guys one of the most dangerous builds you can make in 2K22, but for NBA 2K23. This build is 6'2", 165 pounds, with a 6'9". 6'2", meta? 6'2", meta? He unlocked the jelly layups. Damn. He wants you to make a 90 driving layup and 85 for the contact dunks for next year, man. Is he confirming that we can have a build system like this? Similar build system next gen? You can have all these stats right here and then a, a nice three. What y'all think? Leak, 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 leak. But you also have the ability to choose badges like Acrobat, Giant Slayer, and Fearless Finisher so you can easily fit. Is he confirming these badges for 23? Then look, it says 23 right here. Leak, 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 leak. 
finish at the rim. Layups not being in 2K22 is unrealistic to unrealistic. basketball. In fact, I've done you. a whole year of top 10 plays of the week, 40 episodes, and rarely uh, have I seen anybody do any spectacular layups. I mean, if if a talented player like myself or other people went and tried to do these jelly and acrobatic layups, they could do them, but there's no point to do them because you could just go dunk the ball and... You know, so I don't, I don't know, man. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't know, man. But it, it has to be controlled, bro. Cause I don't, I don't, I don't know how I feel about that. Y'all, let me know how y'all feel about it. You want to turn this build into Trey Young or Steph Curry? Teardrop, Hall of Fame teardropper, and do teardropper back leaked. Do floaters. You also have an 85 driving dunk, which means you have the pro contact dunks, where you can catch bodies with a 6'2 point guard. Now look at this mid range. You get a 90. Bro, to be honest, dude, when you have a high dunk, there's no reason to go this high with your layup, bro. There, there's just no reason because dunks are faster than layups. So it's like, why? What's the point? Unless when you start going for contact dunks, then you want to like acrobat out of it. But that's the only way I could like really see justifying like your layup 90 and your dunk. There's no, there's no point just from a meta perspective. Like you could put other shit elsewhere because you could go dunk every play instead of even doing a layup like yeah. and once again this is all still speculation until we actually get our hands on 2k23 but after playing it it really did feel like layups are finally back so i'm layups glad to welcome back, back the guards that can get buckets in the okay. paint the damian lillards donovan mitchell's john okay. morant's kyrie irving's and leak, steph curry that can leak, layups. Leak, leak. Well, here's some footage of a very similar build Okay, let's get into some more 2K23 news, man. So, Brother Jones tweets out, bring back the 21 court from 2K16 and NBA 2K23. These courts was lit. Okay. This has a lot of likes, right? Right? But I, I, I was there, man. I don't... Man, I don't know. For the most part, bro, I barely seen people play this. Maybe, like, randoms and stuff, but it... It wasn't like overcrowded. Um, they, they, um, the reason they probably took it out because they saw that people barely played it. The same with the Jordan Wreck, which um a lot of people been uh begging for, but like they never played it. So, so even though that should still be a feature, but you know the reason they made the matchmaking is because they saw that people was running, bro. Like you know people were scared and and all that. Like they wouldn't play. Um, I personally think. They should have both implemented one where you, you could, you know, walk and see people and then another where it's matchmaking. Right. And they should implement this, too, but not too much time on it because, you know, it ain't going, you know, I don't know. Y'all let me know if y'all even want this back. But, um, yeah, I, I think uh, you should be able to wear clothes in both of the, the Jordan wreck. I don't I don't understand the point of the jerseys. The shit is retarded, bro. Come on, man. Let nigga style out. 2K Intel tweeted this out. Disappear, right? Hype the game up. Uh, Mike Wang, you know, he just tweeted. He's going to hype the game up. Act like you listen to the community. Drop the game. Disappear. <laughs> this is the cycle of Mike Wang. Do y'all think he's going to repeat this cycle? Do y'all think Mike Wang is like the fucking avatar, but real life, where there's no happy ending, nigga? <laughs> Oh shit! You got me. <laughs> Look at this nigga. <laughs> you got me. You got me. <laughs> Red-handed. You did, <laughs> bro. If Mike Wang uh, responded or did a video like that, that shit would erupt the community. That shit would be hilarious. So, fun fact: apparently, LD2K is awful at shooting in 2K22. Man, the easiest uh. Shooting 2K. This is kind of crazy, man. I, I, don't, I don't know. Anywho, man, make sure y'all subscribe if you're new, man. We're going to be covering all the 2K23 news, best builds, best dribble moves, best jump shots, hilarious toxic gameplay tips. So turn them noty, subscribe, hit that like button. But hey, hey, here we go again. Yeah. Here, here we go again. People talking this for when this hit the fan. Everything I'm that made me. Now break it down. Yo, off the top of the dome, dome.